All right, welcome back more into the dungeon. This time with the hunter. The hunter uh, does not have the reload thing that the marine has, nor the armor that he starts with, but he does have a little doggy friend, which has a chance to find items in rooms, which is actually pretty handy. Uh, also has a crossbow, which is actually a really good weapon when you can hit people with it. Oh god, off to a stellar start. See if we can can last any longer than the last one, which is about 10 minutes. So, first one down. Always seem to lose some life early when I'm trying to talk and play this game. It's difficult, it's tricky to concentrate. I don't know how people do this. Okay, so I've done some reading since the last episode, I've done some boning up, and I know a few more tips and tricks now. Oh god, <laughs> nope. Um, so hopefully I'll actually be able to do some of the things you're supposed to do, like with that great keeper from the shop last time around. So if this turns out to be totally embarrassing, I just won't even upload it so nobody will even see this. Yeah, nice. Oh dear. Okay, ooh, nearly walked into that. Ooh, ammo. Okay, that's useful. So the crossbow does have limited ammo as opposed to our regular sidearm, but it is kind of a one hit kill for a lot of the enemies, especially the standard. These guys. One hit kill. There we go. Whoops. If you hit. Nice. Okay, and a blank. Okay, it's pretty good. So, health is not doing great, but everything else is doing pretty well. Oof. Let's see how it goes. Be nice to beat the boss, get to the second floor, get some stuff working, get some stuff happening. Oh, God. Come on, James. Okay. It's just. Suppressing fire. These things, the books, are, I find really tricky to deal with. When I first encountered them, I'm pretty sure one of them killed me. They fire very random kind of shot patterns. Ah, okay, first chest. We'll come back to that once we cleared the floor and we know what we want to spend our key slash keys on. These guys as well can be pretty tricky mage things but not too bad if you kill them quick they're not too bad it's when you get the high numbers of enemies that the game gets really tricky because you have to start juggling things you have to start prioritizing targets ah boss okay cool um so yeah like i said i did some reading up visited the gungeon subreddit Ooh, this is new all right what's this do the shrine to a forgotten bullet who laid down his arms. Will you? Uh, okay, I think. Uh, if I go in here. Nope. Maybe here. Drop. Uh, ah, okay. Drop things. How do you drop things? This is one of the things that I looked up. Uh, set down to. I cannot drop that because it is passive, apparently. Okay. Uh, oh, that's my dog. Can't drop the dog. How do I drop a weapon? Uh, this? No. This is a uh, fascinating, fascinating gameplay for you guys. It's in there somewhere. Drop gun. Down. Okay. Pretty sure that's what I was doing. Let's try doing it. Okay. Uh, laid down his arms. Add peace. Live together. Uh, okay. Did, did I... Ooh. Okay. Uh, my crossbow's gone. So something happened. No idea what. Cool. 
<laughs> this is going to happen a lot. All right, well, that, that happened now. Okay, so let's go back over here. And head to, I think, our last unexplored room. That's not too bad. And go. Come on. Okay. Uh, it'd be really nice. Well, there's our shop. Okay, let's go there in a second. No, 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 no. Okay, cool. So, more things. Oh, that was dumb. That was really dumb. Went right into that. Kind of wish I still had the crossbow, but there we go. Hopefully that was a thing worth doing. Uh, I don't really know. Shrine. Hmm. Do you know anything about shrines? Might have to look that up as well. Uh, I don't actually know what these purple guys do, because I'm pretty sure one of them bounced into me before and it did diddly squat. I think maybe they just push you around. So like if you're in a room with holes or water. Uh, that's what you don't want to happen. Alright, let's go to our shop now. Could try and go to the secret floor if this guy has a key. Have to roll the water barrel all the way over. Machine pistol 35. Eh. Ammo I don't need because this is infinite. Keys tempting. And half heart. Could get both of those. And then go to our secret floor. Where's the fireplace? The fireplace here. There's definitely a fireplace somewhere. Let's go and find the fireplace. It was over there. I definitely saw a water barrel somewhere as well. So we need to figure out where these two things are and how they belong together. So, still want to know what that does. I'm at peace. Oh, maybe it's in here. Aha. Uh, nope. Okay. Alright, there's the fireplace. So, where's our water barrel? Oh, God, can we get all the way across here? Can I not just scoop up some of that? Uh, it's not going to be in the boss room. I think it was somewhere over the rainbow. No. Uh, if I can't find it soon, I will give up. So, uh, let's try one last one up here. And if not, I will buy second key and just open both chests I think. This is where you want a gun that shoots ice or water or something like that. Can be handy. Nah, I have no idea. I'm sure I saw a water barrel. No idea where. And to be honest I can't be bothered kicking it all the way over to that one considering I'm kind of rubbish and probably won't be able to achieve anything on the secret floor at this point anyway. Alright. First chest. The hell is that? Meat bra. Meat bun. Let's find out. Heals for a small amount. Ah, okay. Active item. Cool. Let's go to our shop, grab a second key, and then go to our chest. Let's also grab that. Might live to regret spending all my money on to... Ooh, okay. Little bomber. Seems like it could be useful. Let's try it on the boss. Only three shots at a time. What's our boss? Oh, great. It's our old friend. Uh, okay, this appears to be a charge weapon. Ooh, okay. That's interesting. So I mustn't forget that I've got a heal, I've also got plenty of blanks. Oh god. Oh fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna pop that now. And let's charge you up. It's really hard to 
charge a weapon and dodge at the same time. Especially one that takes this long. I might have to ditch the bowler. That's, that's good damage though. There we go. Getting a little bit. Ah, keep forgetting about the tables as well. Okay. Should use tables more. And blanks. And basically all the things that you're supposed to do in the game. You should do them more. What I should do. Come on. Get our first win against... Damn it, that was too late. Get our first win against Gatling Gun. Come on. Gatling Gull. Okay. Sorry for going quiet, I am concentrating quite hard. Ah, when you get hit, it loses the charge on your gun. That's annoying. Okay. Yes. Come on. Right, two more shots. Maybe. Ah, oh, mother. Oh. I hate that guy so much. That was not the best weapon to try and take him down with. It's very difficult to hold a charge. And dodge takes too much finger agility and mental agility uh well that will do for today that was worth a try equally as brief as last time around we'll eventually get to the second floor i hope on a run but for now yeah let's uh say goodbye so thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you enjoy. Keep watching for this and more videos from other games, from other presenters, I guess we are. And don't forget to like, subscribe, share with your friends, all that jazz. Bye!